Hello, and welcome back to God of War. I took a little break. Just, just a small break. Hey, what do you got for me? Hey, Sindri, have you met Mimir? Uh, if you mean the severed head that keeps blinking at me, please keep it away. There is no possible way that's hygienic. What'd you say? Oh, that's nice. Lovely to see you too, Sindri. Nob. I uh, want to have a conversation. Why? Is that a piece of my braided mistletoe arrow adorning your quiver strap? Oh, a little memento of your good pal, Sindri. I'm so terribly touched. Okay. That was a weird moment. We got everything we needed here. We upgraded a lot of our stuff. So, uh, let's keep on exploring. Hmm. What is this? What's here? Whoa, it's a statue. There's things here. There's things here. Hmm. So, wh last time, I think, I took a little break. I didn't bother to check. But I think we spoke to the serpent. And it was the coolest thing ever. I'm sorry if I didn't show as, as much as excitement as other YouTubers, but you know, it's uh, j trust me when I say it's awesome for me because it's been awesome. Can I kill this frog? Oh no, <laughs> they just exploded. They don't. No, it's like they didn't even bother to animate them getting chopped in half. No, it just exploded. Just, it's like destroying Jello and Dishonor One. New map revealed. Area revealed. Is there another Isle of Odin here? What did you say? You're too far away. You have to keep up. Your father did run very fast. This seems like a good place for a boss fight. Oh, look. Ah, could it be? The Eight Thrones. Stop being coy, Ed. Do you know this place or not? Ah, Mimir, the smartest man alive. I know many things. Well, whatever this place is, it looks important. To who? There is little of value here. There's nothing here? Are you, are you sure? Little of value. I mean, it could take the portal, but we, that's not what we need right now. Okay, let's go back up. Let's explore a little more, and then, and then we'll go to, um, we'll go to do the main mission. Ah, what is back here? Hmm. Interesting. And how are we supposed to get this out of here? Can we have a explosive arrow? Niosta. Uh, no. Nothing here. Well, there is something here, but I don't know how to get to it. Unless... Aha! I can't just jump down? Nope. Okay, I have to go around. Damn you! Stupid game. Kratos can, hand Kratos can handle it. Why not I just jump down? You survive much taller height. Much bigger height. Height. The, the, the. Anyway. God, this place is so big. Lots of replayability in game. Hello, birds. Oh, look. The frog is back. What the fuck? Boy, can you not? 
Oh my god, walking over them does kill them. Oh no. And that's a fast way down. Once you retrieve the whetstone, please take utmost care while handling it. It is a priceless relic after all. Okay, you said that s s too many times now. Let's go back. Let's go to the blue marker and then we'll go to the mission. Um, uh, yeah, let's go down. Um, uh, there we go. Anything here? That's a big, wow. It's a big statue. It's a, uh, anything? Do I need to concern myself with anything? Pot! Okay then. Oh, there's nothing over here. Okay. And so the journey continues with Kratos and his son Atreus. Hey, we only have to uh, go over there. The Keep rowing towards the statues of the oarsmen, then thread past between them. Was that? Mimir, you never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and the Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won. But the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses. And for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. <laughs> A rather senseless no waste of precious life. Wouldn't you war agree, is never brother? fun. <sighs> Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, mm. a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got, but of course there's more to that story. Oh my god, hello, hi! My god, it's so cool. Anyway, I'm grinning behind this, uh, this web, this, there's no webcam because I don't know how to do that. Not yet, anyway. Shoot it! Aha! We will go up, boy! And, oh, what's that? Anything? The stuff up there? Hmm? Ah, this thing. Okay, let me go up here first. Hey, can I, uh, thank you. We'll explore that later. Before I fight this thing, I'm gonna save, but that's like, let's see what's going on here. Aha, a chest. Hey, what was that? It's a fragment of a language cipher. We should look for more like this. Okay. Well, that's save. All right. Let's see. Boom. Come on! Oh my god! Sorry, 
Oh, I died. I will get up after I respawn. Oops. Almost spilled my drink. Alright, let's try that again. Uh, yeah, we don't need that. Come on! What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Block, you son of a bitch! They they keep on attacking. I can't dodge. I can't block either. I'm stun locked. Are you fucking kidding me? I can do this. I am stuck. Come on, knock them both out. Yes. Well done. Yes, well done. I think he's uh damaged. Yeah, I'm going to be alright. Let's do this! I've seen one of those before. They look like they walk straight out of it. There we go. Oh my god. That was not supposed to be that hard. I jump down. Nope. All right, it's already opened. Oh! All right, let's go in here. What's going on here? Hmm. Whoa! It's a dragon. Fafnir. I always wonder what became of him. Fafnir? Like Fafnir Storm? Fafnir? The very one. But Sindri said he was a dwarf. He was. And now he's a dragon. Funny how life works, isn't it? He's chained up. Perhaps we should keep an eye out for binding shrines and free the poor bastard. Hi, lads. Yeah, let's free the poor bastard. What's this? So how are we supposed to free them? And how do we know he's not gonna attack us? Is that how it's gonna be? Ah, ah it's uh, nice. I love you. I love you so much. That's how it's gonna be. Okay. That is how it's gonna be, huh? Not even a kiss. No! Are you kidding me? I'm on your side. Okay then. Okay, fine. You want to be like that? Boom. I'll help you, son. Boosh. Yeah, 
I took more damage than I have to. was a constant source of annoyance amongst Aesir and Vanir alike. Then why free him? Trust the recently liberated brother. No one deserves to be held captive like this. Even a greedy little dwarf come dragon. Here. Boy. So, he's just got to attack us anyway. Alright. You know what I want to do? I want to kill that guy before he has uh, before we move on to anything else. Yeah, I did say we're that, that I'm gonna kill that guy, so I'm gonna save. Yeah, save. And then, cause we already got everything, so we're gonna save. And then, now we go fight that guy. You just hang tight, okay? We'll free you soon. Sometimes he won't run when I tell him to run. Whoa. Alright. Now, let's see what we do with you. Take a lot of damage off of him. Can you, uh... Boom! Take this! Take that! Holy shit! Oh shit, no, 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 no. I can't fight, I can't leave this room. Uh, I guess I'll just do that. No, no, fuck! Damn it! We can do this! I believe in us! What the hell? Just. Ugh. I believe in us. Yay. Alright, come on. We can do it. Not good in crowd spaces. Shit! Ah, uh, please! Oh! 
is how it's gonna be, huh? Okay, so I guess I can't beat him. That's the end of that story. I can't beat him. Can we at least free the dragons first? Or is that just impossible? I don't know for certain, though I wager his pension for stealing magical artifacts had something to do with it. Must have stolen a trinket from the wrong Vanir goddess. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, one more. Where's that one less? Uh, where's that? Oh, that oh, it's in there. All right, so we can't save him even if we try. Well, I mean, unless we uh, we replenish our rage or something, we can't get over there now. Oh wait, no, we still can. All right, let's try again. If we don't get it this time, then, uh... I don't know. My God! Yes, more. Come on. can do it! We almost did it! Yes! We did it! Oh my god, I did not believe, I didn't think we would do, be able to do that. And now the dwarf is free. free. Think he'll remember you? I don't know lad, a lot's changed since we last crossed paths. I have legs. Haha, <laughs> I have legs, uh, That's funny. Cause you're a separate head. Oh! Damn it! This is gonna be harder than I thought. I should, uh... Come here! Come here! Nope! 
You're not doing that. Um, yeah. How does that feel? Aha! We did it, son! Now we can free the dragon. Sir. Sir? Is the game broken? Hi. Okay, that was supposed to do something there. Hello, dwarf. Hmm. Nice. We got him. Oh. Never mind. Well, that's the end of that. Yeah, we can still go for some more. Let's go for the blue one. Can I unlock any anything? Oh yeah, this thing. Uh, or this thing. I need more. Head on attack. I don't care about swirly swirl. Axe, axe attack. That's not what I care about. We're barehanded and evade. Oh, that's that. Atreus. Shock aerial damage. Uh, that. And then. Boom. And that's it. Nicely done. Son, I'm proud of you. Let's do the blue mission. That's what I'm calling it. The blue mission. Hi. Hello. <laughs> so cool. I thought I could roll off the thing. Anyway. The fishes. I guess that can't... You don't have any way to get rid of that right now. Not the moment. Blue mission. Right there. Head towards the blue mission. Any more boat stories? Mm -hmm. Odin and Frey were ever married. Love and hate are more closely intertwined than you might imagine. For instance, Odin hates the giants and they him. But Thor's own mother was the giantess Fjorgun, one of Odin's great loves. So Thor's half god and half giant? Where? Once Fjorgun was gone, lonely ages passed. And as war with the Vanya raged, I could see what he really wanted in this bluster. And after no small amount of convincing, they are agreed. For a while there, he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted her so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. The peace held, and I truly believed all had worked out better than I could have planned. But Odin's true face showed itself again in the end. Oh, he won Freya's trust, and she taught him some of her Vanir magic, another choice she would live to bitterly regret. Mm. Sadly, despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. 
The taste of Vanir magic led him to new forms of experimentation and new levels of depravity. Cool, now we can land. That was a very interesting story, Mimir. Mimir. What? Who are you? Are you okay? No, son. My goods are underwater. My men are drowned, and yet their bodies continue to walk the beaches. Hellwalkers. They plague these lands. I was their captain. They died because of me. But these abominations sully their memories. I will find a way to free them from their tortured state. In this, I am determined. Kill the Hellwalker crew. Thunderstorm scattered all three of my ships across the lake. I know not what I did to anger Thor. Oh, that's a way down. Okay. Chest. Treasure. Oh, hi. Nicely done, my boy. And that's the the portal to to the shop. Whoa, Here. square for Boy. this one. Sir. Hey, it's another treasure map. Cool. So, oh, we're supposed to find your crew from those ships. Anything? Besides these small lootables. We. Oh, okay, so we go up from there. What's that head? Gnarly. Hmm. God, I love how how we can hear its breathing. It's so cool. All right. Well. Oh, hold on. That's not what we're supposed to do. And we have all the set, meaning we have gained a lot of XP. Hey, look. I think this is the last one. Might as well, right? Yeah. Fine. Might as well. Thank you. Come here. Nicely, nicely done. So we can. Yeah. Come 
Come on, let me stun him. Oh, that's so cool. Almost got him. Nice. Another spirit who wants something from us. What's wrong? I came to this lake with a group of tradesmen, seeking refuge from the desolation. But how could we know it was even worse at the Lake of Nine? We cannot undo your mistake, spirit. I know that. But I fear for my captain and crew. I believe they are still under the water. Will you find them for me? Is there anything you can offer us in return? I... I have little to offer. Oh. Well, I'm not sure... Wait! I died wearing a valuable family heirloom. It's yours, if you promise to find my crew. Deal. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> have my... F have, my have my stuff. Have my family heirloom. Why didn't you or mom ever tell me about the desolation? I won't speak for your mother. But it was never my concern. Nor should it be yours. Doesn't it concern us if everything around us is dying? Our only concern is reaching your nine. Really? Then why are we exploring all these islands? The resources we find improve our equipment. Oh my god, that's so we useful. From the path. It is only to Holy shit. Okay, come on. You have Major Maker. Boom! No match for me. Nice. What's that? Well, that is a very nice uh, job well done. No, not ready to go back yet. Not until we unlock this chest. Hmm. Damn it. There we go. Never mind. Are you kidding me? There you go. Got it. Health? Please? Yes! Two out of three. I thought we'd collect more than that. Well. Burgers can't be choosers. Hey, what is that? Didn't see that before. It's one of those very difficult enemies. Can't walk here. No, no. Don't black out on me. 
So, oh, I see it. Anything here? Oh yeah, we have, uh, we got the, the thing. Lots happening. It's so creepy. Awesome at the same time. Right. I discovered opportunities for hunting and trade in these lands. I gave up my search for Jotunheim long ago. Leave that for the younger, more hopeless. Boy, what a sad story. Yes. We should help him. Really? You are surprised. Well, yeah. I don't think you'd care about helping Spirit. Fighting more Hellwalkers is good experience for you. Oh. Oh. So that's why you want to help him. Well, let's see what we can do. Oh my god, there's so much side missions. Uh. Let's go there. Oh my god, that's a lot of markers. We're almost done. Okay. Obviously, we could go a little more. more. Last, but how did Fran up the hermit in the woods? Oh, that was a singular piece of cruelty, even for Odin. As if the marriage wasn't punishment enough. Freya was better to him than he deserved. She stuck it out through all manner of indignity, all in the name of maintaining peace and safety for her people. But Odin's madness, his tyranny, his corruption of her magics, it became more than she could stomach, and at long last she broke it off. Odin's wrath was fierce, and his curses upon her were more than she dared to fear. But her magic was so much stronger than his. After so much time together, he knew her vulnerabilities, and exploited them to craft curses she could never break. Oh, like not being able to leave Midgard. Worse still, he robbed her of a warrior spirit. Freya cannot fight, even to defend herself. No living thing may she harm by blade nor spell. In a world like this belligerent, what choice does she have but isolation? Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. I lied. So would I. Hmm. Is that? Aha! Think you can hide from me? Hey, you're about to take off. Hello, Froggy. Okay, I guess not. There's an explosive back there. I need to get to that. From here. Can you see that? Nope. I certainly can. Gimme loot. Looty loot. Precious loot. Yes. Oh my god, look at all those frogs. Uh, whoa! Crabs! He's a dead crab now. Alright. And we can go over there? No, we cannot. How do we, uh... What is that? Hold on. Whoosh! It's not doing anything. Alright, I have to go somewhere else for that. I promise you, in the next episode, we will continue the story. Almost done here. I see something down there. You see something? Oh, that's the thing we just got. A little sound. I like the little sound they make when they are, when they are being extracted. Anything? <laughs> Hello. Oh, Look at that. 
Maybe. You sure can, buddy boy. Oh, hello. Whoa. <laughs> uh, Kratos, are you okay there? You got a little too angry. Uh, let's save. Because we know what's going on here. We know what's going on. If you know what's going on, then you will save too. But yeah, he's like, quiet head. Oh! Never mind. I th oh, those were the... What? I'm confused. Okay. But yeah. He's like, quiet head! A little bit more but louder than that. But, yeah. Who is shouting? I don't want to shout because I don't want to blow out the microphone. Hey, it's another one of those glowy things. Wow, there was another shipwreck under the water. It's amazed. I'm, it's, I'm amazed how old this is underneath the water. Before. Here. There was a shrine about a giant lady. Lots of books and, and visions. Ah, that was the Gloa, the knowledge keeper. She was a gifted sorceress. What? Who gathered every tome was the sorcery? Find in the realms, what the fuck? All in the hopes of augmenting her powers of prophecy that she might find her lost husband, Arvandil. It was not her husband she would glimpse in her visions. For it was Groa, seeing longer and farther than any before or since, who witnessed Ragnarok, the end and the beginning. When Odin caught word of her ultimate prophecy, he maneuvered oh, to obtain crap. her knowledge and hoard it for himself. Groa knew Odin as a long-time patron of her services, and so she welcomed him into her library as a friend. What she did not know is that Odin himself was behind her husband's disappearance, having used his enchantments to conceal his death at Thor's hands from her sight. Smiling, jealous Odin took her by the throat, and with his very hands he stole her library and her life for his own. Mm. I always knew Odin was bad, but that's just... Ruthless? Barbaric? Heartless? That's Odin. In fact, we would do well to sit here in silence for the next few moments and reflect on Odin's capacity for cruelty. Why is the god so so, so much, much of an asshole? Every god. Doesn't matter which realm, which reality, which universe. They're always an asshole. Well, not not really. Not in the Marvel Cinematic. Blah, 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 blah. I just gotta say the MCU because that's a uh, very... Uh, too much to talk about. I think we we'll have to use our hand here. Come here! Have a war with you. Never mind, you're dead. Were all those guys part of his crew? That's a tough crew. And all his responsibility. That's a lot of responsibility. Does it frighten you? Uh responsibility oh uh no i don't think so i mean i think it used to but not as much anymore why is that well being out here with you makes me feel more grown up <laughs> i think this is a soul eater so i'm gonna fight it next episode all right cool Okay, goodbye. We're done here.